Tonight, more questions than answers after a gunman opened fire at Top Supermarket in Buffalo, killing 10 and injuring three others. This was an act of evil. Yes, it was. Evil. The U.S. Justice Department now investigating Saturday's mass shooting as both a hate crime and as a case of racially motivated violent extremism. Officials in Buffalo say the suspects streamed the attack live on a social media site and say they are reviewing an online document that includes a desire to provoke racial violence. This was no other way to describe it than white supremacy terrorism. It's racism. It's hatred. And it stops right here in Buffalo. This is the last stop you're going to have because we are coming after you. The 180 page document, including a detailed account of the attack and what is believed to be a drawing of the store. It also contains racist language and the suspects plan to kill, in his words, as many black people as possible. I've seen some of the most despicable things that you can imagine, but this one hurts me to my heart because here's a community on the upbound coming back and the violence that's attacking this is not from here but from outside. Investigators now zeroing in on what they're calling a manifesto. In it, the alleged shooter saying that white people are at risk of being replaced by people of color. This was pure evil. It was straight up racially motivated hate crime. Investigators also saying the suspect legally purchased the gun in the shooting, but modified it and added illegal high capacity magazines. How he obtained them remains a mystery. Buffalo, New York will never be the same, dear Lord Heavenly Father. Tonight, vigils and memorials. The east side neighborhood of Buffalo particularly hit hard as residents deal with the reality of the weekend violence.